Welcome to Crowded Lab. Today I am doing Keyword Hero review and demo and I am really excited to show you this tool because in my opinion it has potential to be a great one. And I am telling you that because this tool combines four in one. First you will do your keyword research with this tool, you will be given needed metrics like keyword difficulty or profitability score so you can target the correct keywords. Then you will be able to build outline for your article. Then inside Keyword Hero, you will be able to write your article. And if it's not enough, you will be able to optimize your content right inside this tool. And one more option it provides, there is a checkbox you can check to ask provide AI undetectable content. So this tool combines four in one, keyword research tool, AI writer, content optimizer and AI undetectable software. So regarding plans, there are different options. With all plans, you're given so-called AI credits. We'll see how we'll be spending those but one AI credit will allow you to generate outline for your article and four AI credits will be spent to write full article. There are other metrics like keyword lookups per day, how many content plans you can have and number of keywords per plan. So see for yourself how many searches and keyword analysis you will need monthly and choose appropriate plan for yourself. Maximum what you can have for almost $500, 60 AI credits monthly. So it will translate roughly to 12 articles per month that you can write. But separately, there are other metrics for keyword lookup and content optimizations. So you can use this tool for a full cycle to analyze keywords, write an article, optimize it, or you can use parts of this tool. Keyword Hero just recently launched on Product Hunt, so they are starting getting traction there as well. Here's their main website. Yeah, as I mentioned, they're starting to get traction on Product Hunt and overall tool looks solid. It is not just a freshly baked one. Definitely it is a startup, but this looks very promising and solid. So let's actually start using this tool. To test this one, I will use this initial keyword, how to save on car rentals. You can enter here short keyword like car rentals and you will be given ideas for your keywords. But let's start like I just did. All right, so here it is the result. We are given more ideas for our keywords but let's just look for car rentals. Let's go. Imagine you are not sure the topic you want to write about, so you're given keyword ideas. You can then cluster keywords. Similar keywords will be clustered like so. Maybe you want cheap car rentals. Ah, I see. This one actually removes it from parent topic. Okay, not a problem. So you're getting some ideas here. Okay, so not a very good example like Hertz car rentals. It has difficulty 100. Definitely you are not going to write for such topic. But just for an example and because I am limited in the trial plan, I'll show you how it works basically. When you choose a particular keyword to the right, you will see different kinds of metrics for the keyword of your choice. You will get search volume, cost per click, minimum recommended domain power to start competing for this keyword and suggested quantity of backlinks. And for this one, you are given direct recommendation. Stay away from this one because Hertz is a well-established car rental company known worldwide. So there are tons of articles about that particular car rental company. 
But anyway, just for an example, let's continue with this one. And getting back to the main power and links, those are custom metrics, which are tracked by Keyword Hero. So they are counting that on their own. Down below, we are getting first results in Google. I believe we are getting close to 100 first results. Also, if we will look to the left, we can apply filters for our keyword research. Okay, so what would you do next? You can select several keywords. In my case, I'll select this one, and then you can add that to your content plan. Let's add that. Okay, so then we are going to this section, content creation. Once you're done choosing your keywords, I think I didn't choose that particular one, but we also have an option to add that manually. We can apply some notes for ourselves or our team members. We can label a particular keyword to be in different states. Okay, so let's choose that. And here we are adding content analysis. Okay. This one in particular is similar, I believe, to what NeuronWriter is doing. All right, so I believe our content analysis is ready. So let's go and check it. All right, so yeah, this view is similar to NeuronWriter. So in my case, those are not showing. Maybe I'm reaching the limit of my trial plan. But anyway, the normal flow, how you would proceed with this tool. First, it will go to Outline Builder and based on the top results, you will be suggested an outline. All right, so we are getting very detailed outline. And to the right, I see a very nice option that I didn't see in any other tool. You can specify the number of words per particular section. You can add additional instructions. There are additional options that you can give to AI Writer. For example, here I'm asking to add a car rental related joke and let the length of this section will be 100 words. So you can play with the outline. Not sure what this one will do, but let's check that and reflect outline updates in content analysis. Okay, yeah, I see if you are getting back to guidelines, we are actually getting updated score. 80 already. Not sure about that yet because we are just getting outline. But anyway, I will be interested in comparing that to neuron writer score, maybe in a separate video, if there will be interest for this tool from the audience. All right, so once you're done with your outline, you will go to AI content writer. And right in this tool, you will be given different options. I'm limited here for my trial account, but anyway, Let's check first person singular. Here we can see very important settings like NLP optimization. Yes, you will be able to scrape fresh content. That is a great option. And just having this feature raises this tool above many others. And in AppSumo plan, you will have pass AI detection feature available as well. Here you can give additional guideline. For example, right as you have broad experience in renting cars at least twice a month. And let's write the content. All right, so here we are. We are getting our content right inside the same tool. And let's get back to our guidelines. Based on the metrics from Keyword Hero, you are getting the score 86. So you're getting some additional metrics as well like content structure, readability, NLP terms. Please pay attention that it shows honestly that readability is not the greatest. So I believe you will need to work on that. 
you're getting as well close to 3000 words. I'm not sure what some of the metrics mean here, like word count. Yes, this is our count, but what does it mean one, two here or paragraphs? Yep, not sure. I think maybe I know the reason. Maybe due to limitations of my trial account, I was not getting full analysis for this part because I think we should see here more terms in headings and in content. It should be similar to this view from NeuronWriter. Anyway, you get the idea in general, how would you work with this keyword hero tool? All right, so let's move to the conclusion after a quick overview and demo of keyword hero. At the first glance, this tool really looks promising because you can combine keyword research, writing content and optimizing it right in one tool. But at the same time, I have some doubts how good this tool is as a keyword research tool. So ideally it needs to be compared to some competitors. And in terms of content optimization, I'm interested to compare that to NeuronWriter. Let's see if there will be interest in this keyword hero tool. So I believe it worth some additional videos. But overall, the tool looks really promising. It feels like a solid tool, which can give you enough functionality, write what you need to write articles. For example, there are keyword research tools like Ahrefs or SEMrush, which will give you much more functionality regarding keywords, but to be able to write great articles, you don't need all of that. You will need difficulty, search volume, cost per click, some additional suggestions like is this keyword difficulty hard, how profitable is that, and basically you can look at the trends and you don't need much more than that if those provided numbers are correct. So yeah, that was Keyword Hero introduction. Please check my affiliate link in the description to check Keyword Hero. Please also give this video a like and subscribe for more similar videos. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.